Hi guys, today I am going to discuss about how to install SQL Server Data Tools SSDT for Visual Studio 2017. So first we need to or download Visual Studio or 2017 and or click or this site visualstudio.com So right here we have different types of Visual Studio available. So download anyone. So I recommend you to use Visual Studio Enterprise. So I already uh, download and uh, install. So if you like to know how to download and install Visual Studio 2017, so here. Yeah. Or check this my video how to download and install Visual Studio 2017 in Windows 8 8.1 10. So I already installed, so I'm not going to download and install again. So right here, let's uh, see Visual Studio 2017. So I do go to file. Here after so see at here there is no any business intelligence or templates available. So we need to first download and install. So for this, let's go to uh, Google. And here, write SSDT for Visual Studio. Or write SSDT download. So click this one, download SQL Server Data Tools. So this is the official site of Microsoft. So at your download SQL Server Data Tools. So here yeah, this link, download SQL Server Data Tools 17.1. So this is available for Visual Studio 2015. So for Visual Studio 2017, I'll go down. So right here, use SSDT in Visual Studio 2017. So download first, need to download. So this is highly recommended. Download Visual Studio 2017 and compare. And here, to use relational database project, we recommend you to check in data storage processing. So here, this all. And SSD database project in Visual Studio 2000, current support SQL Server 2016. So, it support 2016 SQL Server. So, you, uh, before installing SSDT for Visual Studio, so I recommend you to first install SQL Server 2016 and support for SQL Server 2017 will be coming soon in Visual Studio update. If you are using SSDT with Visual Studio 2017, so install AS and RS component. So first let's click this one. Analysis service. And here or uh, this uh, check this one Microsoft Analysis Service. Microsoft. So yeah, Microsoft Analysis Service project provide project template this all. So this is Microsoft Power BI. So download this one. So the size is uh, 
322.11 MB so click on download hereafter I am going to pause the download and next we need to download reporting service so click this link also and download or Microsoft reporting service project so click the download here yeah, this size is 92.20 MB so click the download so now I am going to pause the video